Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. In this video, we'll check out the following. First, how we can get $1000 worth free credits to use Google Gemini models. Second, how to get API key for using Gemini models. And last, pricing for these Gemini models. So let's get started. Now the first thing that we want to do is get those free credits. For that, you need to go to cloud.google.com and with the new account, you need to sign in. That way you'll get a thousand dollars worth of credit to use in Google Cloud. Now these credits can be used for the API keys as well. So this way you will get started. The next step would be to get the API key. Now for that, you need to go to aistudio.google.com, click on get API key. It will throw you to this page. Now on this page, you'll see an option to create the API key. When you click on it for the first time, if you're new to Google Cloud, it will show you a default free of charge project. You can select that, but you'll be rate limited. But if you have done this first step correctly, you'll have a lot of free credits. So to use those, you can create another project and select that project. That way you'll not be rate limited and you'll have an API key. I've created, I've already created an API key and I've copied it. Once you create it, you won't be able to see it again. So copy this API key and save it at a safe place. The next step is checking out the pricing for these models. If you select pay as you go model, then you need to know what is the pricing for Google Gemini models. Google basically offers two main models. One is Gemini 1.5 flash. Another one is Gemini 1.5 pro. Pro is the bigger model, which costs more. Flash is a comparatively newer model and it is fast, but it is trained on less data and it costs less. Now, if you use the free tier, then you'll be remitted to 15 requests per minute. But if you use pay as you go subscription, you will be limited to 1000 requests per minute, which is a huge number. So these were the numbers for Gemini 1.5 flash. What about 1.5 pro? Well, there in the free subscription, you can only request two times per minute, which is, which is really less. But if you select pay as you go subscription, you have a decent 360 requests per minute. So select the subscription as per your need and then uh, create the API key and use those. The next step that I want to show you is what kind of pricing these models offer. So Gemini 1.5 flash, which is the cheaper one, offers a free of charge subscription as we saw, but it is rate limited. If you want to use use pay as you go subscription you will see that the pricing is 0.075 dollars per 1 million tokens these are input pricing similarly for output the pricing is 0.30 dollars recently all of these ai models have also started context caching which you'll learn in a newer video which basically can help you get rid of rag implementations if you have smaller set of documents we'll look at that in a future video so we'll have the pricing for that as well if i click on gemini 1.5 pro again you have a free of charge tier but in the pay as you go tier you will see that input price has increased significantly it is 3.5 dollar per 1 million input tokens similarly for output tokens, pricing is $10.5. So that's, that's comparatively uh, a lot expensive. So for learning purpose, I would suggest click on Gemini 1.5 flash and use that in your API. So that was it for this video. In the next video, we'll learn how we can use this API key to call Gemini models via the SDK. Please like the video and subscribe to the channel. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.